What's going on, world? It's your boy, Kuya P. This is the NR Dub. Nerds rule the world. And I'm here with my brother, Glenn Lawrence, to talk another, to talk about another great trailer coming our way. Well, we don't know if it's great. I don't know. I'm I'm giving it some love already off the bat, and I don't even know what it's all about yet. But uh, we're here to do it. Glenn Lawrence, are you ready to do another trailer reaction? You know, it's infamous. It's what we do. I'm 100% ready. We're infamous. Let's get it. All right. So to, today's trailer... Um, when I first heard or caught wind of this, uh, I'm a proud Filipino, as you know. I like to rep my people, I rep my, rep my culture. When I heard that my peoples was doing a Transformers-esque type film, and uh, mad love to my people over in the Philippines, but they don't got budgets like we got here in the States. <laughs> right. I'm like, word? We doing a Transformers-style film? Okay. I, I-, I got to see what the hell y'all talk about. Um, Glenn? They they're doing a Transformers S style film, and it's called okay. Trans Mutators. Okay. A little on the nose, I think. Okay, you ready to check this out, Glenn? I don't know if I'm ready, but let's do it. Let's go, Trans Mutators. Here we go. Already doing too much. It's so <laughs> distant future. Already doing it. A green oh. legal catastrophe has brought about an alien invasion leaving our world in terror now a desperate group of survivors unite in a secret sanctuary it must be found now an ex-military colonel is a reluctant hero who must rise from the ashes and lead a band of unlikely warriors. Their enemy, a ruthless force of mutated humans. Go! And the alien conquerors themselves. In order to survive, they must battle their technologically advanced enemy in any way they can. Using robots engineered from recycled parts of forgotten machines. Now you die! Get set for a movie that'll bring on the heavy metal. Transmutators. The logo is even very transmutated. Save the planet. All right, there you go, Glenn Lawrence. No old spice there. Um, trans mutators, bro. What you think, bro? <laughs> I might walk out of this. That I can't believe you should. No, uh, <laughs> what did I just watch? What did I just watch? Uh, when was this made? Um, I don't know, but it's coming to digital on May 2nd and Apple TV. Wow. <laughs> It looks like it was made in 1989. <laughs> it's definitely got that 80s B-movie vibe. Oh, man. I'm here for it. I'm here for it, to be real. Oh. Maybe that's my culture, my people's <laughs> talking to me. But I don't know. I'm kind of here for it. It looks so bad, but so bad it's good bad. Uh, you know what? I feel like this is one of those things. Like, you know, when you say, like, oh, it's a silly concept, but they took it seriously, and it's like, fun. I hope they did not take this seriously. I hope that they did, They like you said, they do the maximum amount of camp with it. It looks uh, like that's what it deserves, like the maximum amount of camp. And in that vein, I will say, okay, that's cool. <laughs> but if they try to make it like, like no, 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 we're serious. This is, this is what we, it, it'll be like the room, you know what I mean, where it's just like. <laughs> what just what am i just watching it yeah. is interesting though when you look at like indie films and you, like what makes a film like is they're shooting with the same angles they're doing the same thing what makes this film look like like uh you know like b movie versus like you know the cinematic uh films that you you get from other places when you get you know big budgets i don't know there's just something about the look of it that was that was throwing me off it seemed like the acting was a, a like a touch slow or whatever <laughs> but uh uh, it it's it looks like it would be a wild Saturday afternoon watch. You know what I mean? Like yeah. after I've had a few beers and I'm laying on the couch and I, this pops on TV, I'm like ah, and you know just check it out just for the the thrill of it. Um, but it's a cool P. I don't know, man. This is. <laughs> I, I, did did you real. did you like it though? Are you are you with it? Are you are you hyped for it or what? What you thinking? Real talk, it looks terrible. <laughs> terrible. It looks terrible. <laughs> but with that being said. 
the culture compels me. My people compel me. <laughs> I love it. It's got that eighties bad vibe, but again, the 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 logo was a direct ripoff of Transformers. The title calling it Transmutators. Just everything about it is. I'm not surprised. My people, I love my people. But it was uh, like also like it wasn't it wasn't really a ripoff of Transformers as much as it was a ripoff of Pacific Rim. <laughs> <laughs> all but they gave no they gave no props to Pacific Rim. It's like that's you it's a kaiju. Dude, and when you see the poster, the, the robot they're using using on the poster is red and blue, like Optimus. It's got it it's got like straight up like they're trying to capitalize for off of uh Transformers love and all that. But as we saw, it's Pacific Rim, it's all of the things, but uh I, I, I'm not surprised by my people. I got love for my people. It's what we do. <laughs> it looks it looks it looks great, you know what I mean? For the culture, yeah. I love it. Uh, yeah. And like I said, I would check it out on a lazy, lazy Saturday, lazy Sunday. I'd check it out with some alcohol. Definitely a lot of alcohol, alcohol and some yeah, food. Yeah, exactly. It's a it's a lazy Saturday afternoon kind of film, bro. Yeah, in the middle of a nap, I I throw this on. You know what I mean? <laughs> All right, y'all. Those are our feelings about Transmutators. Let us know uh, if you're checking it out. If I'm wrong, if it's the greatest movie of all time. I love my people, but I don't know. Glenn Lawrence, how can they talk about Transmutators with you? Levelupcomedy.com. Glenn Levels Up on Twitter. Glenn Lawrence Comedy on Facebook and IG. All right, y'all. And for me, it's the legend Cooley P on Twitter, TikTok, IG, Hive. And, of course, here with Glenn and the whole squad at the NRW and Annual Release Wednesday where nerds rule the world. Transmutators, my Philippines people, my, my Filipinos, everybody. I love y'all. It's, it's who I am. It's what I will always continue to show love to. But y'all, we we crazy with this one. Real crazy. We you out. crazy for this, Rick? <laughs> <laughs>